come a long way, haven't we? <laughs> so look, as an, someone who used to be a vegan, when I had that salmon, how terrible, you know, that thing was, but it wasn't actually all, all that bad when I actually had it, just like the idea. Hot dogs? For real? Real hot dogs? Well, let me tell you. So, this is actually not the first time I've actually had had this. So, this is just a grass-fed, organic hot dogs. I would not eat anything else, but I saw that I was like, okay, that's pretty interesting. And then, several months later, I'm like, okay, let me buy it again, and let me actually make a video for it this time. I didn't, I didn't show the whole first first time that I ended up having it. So. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, here it is. And I'm sure you're wondering why the heck is it on a wrap? I don't know. That's like the best thing compared to a hot dog bun that I could find, that I could get. I normally like a pickle on it, but I, I didn't have any pickles. Well, no, I didn't have it. I, I had pickles. I just already had a pickle today, and that's too much sodium. So I'm like, okay, you know, because this already has a lot of sodium as it is. So it's like, I don't want to be all sodium sodiumed up. We also have one ingredient in french fries that are no longer sold. So yeah, that kind of sucks. We got them in here. There you go. And and they're a bit cold by it now because I, I, I cook these first in the air fryer. The hot dogs will cook second in the air fryer. Very, very good. 400 degrees, five minutes. There you go. Got my vegetables. Got my um, cheese and ketchup and mustard and a little bit of hot sauce on it. There you go, french fries. So sure you want to see me eat it I'm not gonna show you okay I will show you hmm you know this is a cringe to be completely honest with you it is it is cringe very 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 cringe but let's see it just it just make makes me cringe hard just thinking about it it just does. I'm sure you wonder, like, why the heck do you do it then? I don't even know anymore at this point. <laughs> I just don't even know. Yep. Now, what's interesting is, like, when I had it again after, you know, so so long, like many, many years, and not having a hot dog, and then I had it, I'm like, oh, it was, it's not actually bad. But then the thought goes in my mind, it's like, mmm, I don't, you know what I mean? It's like, mmm. So, yeah, it, it's a difficult thing to wrap your, your head around to like, okay, okay. Right, what I like about this though is I can taste the celery a lot. The, the celery is, is what's really good. Now, the other interesting thing I noticed, and I think this is why I didn't want to buy it again, but then I remembered like after I bought it at this point, anything that has like a high amount of animal fat or maybe it's the cholesterol I end up having like heart palpitations after I eat it like anything that I have that has a lot of I don't know if it's necessarily just like eating cheese because cheese has a lot of cholesterol but um it could be the be, uh, be the calcium I know I've had like a like my milk you know that is that's not cows cow's milk there's no cholesterol in it but it has calcium in it and that and that I know that has caused me to have that before so I'd be interested because each hot dog is like 25% your daily value of saturated fat. Plus it has some cholesterol. And I have a little bit of cheese, but if I don't get heart palpitations, then yeah. So, I don't know. I'm going to go eat this now, so you all take care of a great one, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.